Orchid Chopsticks presents the Chinese tea drinking culture. Tea drinking in China dates back to the 2nd century BC. Hi there, welcome to Orchids. Today we like to show you how to make a Kung Fu tea. Kung Fu Tastan drink tea is a traditional Chinese method of preparing tea with these Chinese tea wares. Um, these size are, you can see it's much more smaller than the ordinary size. These little vessels can give us a, a lot of more control in the temperature and the flavor of the tea to get the best taste. So, Kung Fu tea is the best idea. It's the ideal tea to make the, any type of Chinese tea, it's like green tea, white tea, wulong, or black tea, pua tea, any tea. So, we need this kai wan. This is a little bowl called kai wan. Uh, instead of the pipe one, you could use this Yixing Zhisha clay. This clay pot is tiny ski pot, also smaller size. So we could adjust the, with this, make the smaller portion of the tea, adjust the taste what we want, the lighter or thicker. So we could get the, the taste, we adjust the taste we want. Then it can, instead of brewing in the big pot like this is the taste is can better so you adjust the tea you want so so instead of brewing in the big pot the tea is over steeping and can better so that you could say that if the tea leaves are not wasted as well because it's a smaller portion then and we have this little cups. It's a tasting cup to taste the tea and to enjoy the aroma. Just to decide, it's just to focus the attention of the taste on tea itself. It's full taste of the tea, smaller size. So we will have this. The little jar, this one is we call Kong Tao Pei. Kong Tao Pei is, it can even at the infusion to get the fair and square taste. We are not going to pull from this cup, making tea cup to the little, little cups there. Because in this way, the first cup is the taste of the tea in the first cup will be much more stronger than the last cup. That's why. To get the fair taste, we use this fair cup. To get a fair and square date, we use this the fairness cup. This is the necessary. And we wait. Now we put the tea leaves into the little bowl. We use the oolong tea which is half fermented. Antioxidants and many benefits on your health. Then we will put the water on it. We use about 90 degrees Celsius water. This is the first brew, I will not drink it because this bubbles is shrink the tea. and bulbs are opened up and the tea is hydrated. It's more aromatic also. It's time to enjoy the tea smell as well. Beautiful smell. This one is Anxi Wulong tea which is half fermented with a low oxidation. And it's like, it's very, very attractive with the tones of the fresh flowers. And so it's a uh, warm. It's important to warm at the tea way as well by uh, washing the tea leaves at the same time. We warm up the tea way 
So it's maintain the temperature of the tea well and it extracts the tea essence, the flavor of the tea. Then this first row, I will pour on my the little pads, little tea pads, my five blessing piggy, and my lucky frogs. Rinse the tea and um, warming up the tea waste. So, this is the real time to brew. This first infusion will be about 30 seconds. And this one for the light fermented oolong tea, about 30 seconds. For green tea, it would be a maximum 80 degrees Celsius water and about 25 seconds for the first infusion first straw. If you choose the poor tea, if like this black tea, poor tea, it would be 100 degrees Celsius water and 30 seconds for the first straw. the leaves around with the leaves and it's the leaves then go the tea into the famous cup and share to the leaves Fairness cup is making sure that everybody gets the same taste and instead of the tea is brewing too loud and hot temperature in the cup so it stopped the infusion process and then you dry the aroma and taste of the tea The most delicious tea I've, I've ever had. Yeah, it's really, it's really good. It's yeah, it's thick and strong, but it's not bitter at all. It's yes, it's really creamy, nice, really nice. Yes. Uh, milky without any bitterness. Yes, exactly. It's really nice. Yes, this I is just a, a <laughs> <laughs> this is just the first infusion. You could do is the second infusion, third infusion, and do the four times. Could be infused four times. You, and can get the best flavor, better flavor at the next drop. So, then we add 5 seconds more to the every infusion. Uh, it will be 35 seconds for the second round and 40 seconds for the third infusion. So, this Kung Fu tea, it's, it seems like the unique seven step to make a cup of tea. But actually, it's not and a bit quicker and faster to get the best taste, the best flavor of the tea with the perfect temperature. So, yes, that's all. Okay. So, if you enjoy the video and share for us and like our page, thank you so much yeah. for watching our video. Thanks for your time. Don't forget to like and share our video. Yes, you enjoy. You can enjoy your. Go for tea at home and be healthy. Stay safe. Bye bye. Bye. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoy the video. If you want to experience and feel the utensils presented, we welcome you to our shops. Premier Shop is at 65 Pagoda Street nearest to the Chinatown MRT station. Number 2 Shop is at 25 Trangana Street further down the road, towards the temple. Come and look for me. I am Nana.